guys, and welcome back to another Minecraft episode. I'm here with Buster Socks. Hey guys. And we are chilling here on our new server in a new world, and it's pretty cool. We're kind of going with a kind of like a medieval, uh, Middle Ages theme. Um, no modern houses or anything like that. Um, but yeah, this is our spawn area, and we've been we've been busy. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Um, this is kind of like a little fishing platform. That... Oh, did it vanish? No, I still got it. Oh, I thought it vanished. I was like, oh, it happened. Okay. <laughs> I'm using a uh, curse of curse of the vanishing fishing rod. So after these 15 uh, uses, I guess it's going to be gone forever. But that's kind of like a new enchant that you can get um, in the 1.11 snapshots. Something happens with it. Yeah. <laughs> I think it disappears or something. Or you can't... Or maybe you can't repair it. Yeah, you so. can't repair it. Or if you repair it, it disappears. Right. Um, but yeah, we want to give you guys a tour around. Um, so as you can see, there's some crops over there. Um, straight ahead's kind of a tree farm. Um, then across the bridge over here is kind of like a fishing shack. So I guess we'll go ahead and just go straight across to this dock. And... We'll check out my fishing shack. We both got some depth strider boots. Come in handy. Yeah, they do. Um, this is just like a little chilling spot here. It's kind of cool. We went with the path blocks um, for most of the paths, at least, just because, you know, they... They look traditional. Yeah, and they kind of fit the theme. Yeah, I could see that in, you know, back in the day. Right. Just trod that stuff down with your feet. <laughs> Um, with this bridge, I kind of put some grass on it. it kind of looks pretty cool. A little natural feel to it. Um, we've also kind of added a lot of bone mill around the area to kind of spruce up the landscape. Um, this is Sailor Jerry's fishing shack. So I'm going to head on in, give you guys a little tour. It's kind of cool. Not too, Nothing too fancy about it, but it looks uh, unique. What do you mean? It's got a lapis floor. That's fancy. <laughs> right? Kind of a uh, little little richy. Got the lapis blocks. Nice. nice. Um, these uh, cauldrons are kind of acting like live wells, I guess. A little, uh, little dining area here where you could uh, eat your cooked fish that you catch. Um, and then I got the wraparound porch going on. where Little cutaways where you can fish down here. Um, you can cook your fish. Um, and then there's a little storage chest over here. So, yeah, I guess upstairs. Um, and you can see I got fish in, uh, some item frames. Look kind of cool. All different kinds. Uh, there's kind of a sleeping quarters up here. Got lots of three beds. I guess everybody has to sleep together. <laughs> right. Well, it's big enough. One, one on one side, one on the other. Right. Um, this is my fishing rod. It's got Luck of the Sea 2 and Breaking 3, Lure 3, and Mending, so it's really good. Oh my god. And I know you got one that's pretty close. So. No, that's good. <laughs> I like that rod. Nice. <laughs> also, these, you can uh, just throw your raw fish in there, and they'll go down into the furnaces and start cooking automatically, so that's cool. Little hopper system set up. Yep, yep. Um, I guess we'll go on down and move on. We got a lot of different buildings to show you guys, so yeah, hop to it. Um, this next building over here is actually part of the tree farm. Um, it's basically where you can go and purchase all your supplies. Um, if you go to the other side, you can see where I have item frames with all the different kinds of wood. I probably need to do it on this side also, just to match it. Yeah, that'd be cool. Um, your floor looks really cool. I like your floor with the logs. Oh yeah, it's definitely a different pattern. I was trying something new there. Like a little so sticking with the wood theme, you know. Right. And this is kind of like a little behind the counter action going on. Yeah. It's essentially the store that sells the trees that grow in the back. And then there's some log supplies out back here, which is cool. Or I should say out front. Because it's kind of the front yeah, of the building. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, but yeah, sign here. Got wood? Get it here. Busted socks, <laughs> wood and lumber. I forgot about that sign. Love it. 
Um, we got this cool bridge that Buster Socks built, and it kind of leads over to her crop area, where she's got all different kinds of crops going. We got wheat, potatoes, oh, yeah. carrots, pumpkins. Got some reeds over there, and this is kind of your little storage shack. Yeah, and it's fully stored, as you can see. Oh yeah. Pretty simple in here. Path blocks, hay bales, about as simple as it gets. What do we got back here? Oh, we got this autom fully automated cactus farm, Dang. which is doing pretty well. Oh, yeah. Almost two stacks. Very nice. I've also got a little vine manufacturing area over here. Vine wall. I don't, I don't know what the proper name would be for this. <laughs> Woohoo. Oh, looks like you might be missing them. Yeah, I, I, pro I get careless sometimes. <laughs> Down here, I... Oh, awesome. Some have grown in. I've got a little mushroom room down here where I've hidden mushrooms in the walls, and they'll grow in. I've got kind of spaces cut out, like one-block spaces and little mushrooms hidden back in the walls. Yeah, it's like a little underground cellar. That's pretty cool. Yeah, I got the water dripping down from the ceiling in there and make it seem realistic and awesome. of course there's the nether wart yeah. over here that's a necessity I saw that it looked good it caught my eye yeah <laughs> I guess we'll move on show you guys the other areas we got um looking to the left across the bridge that is kind of like our animal area and right now we got them all bunched together yeah it's just a mess over there <laughs> Um, we'll definitely separate them out and create some nice, um, nice areas for them. Uh, this is just a little chilling bench here where maybe you can hang out and either fish or, you know, read a book or something. Hang out with your sweetheart. <laughs> right. And we have these little pups that we found. This one's Fred. He's cool. <laughs> um, yeah, I'll show you kind of like, I'll just give you guys a glimpse. Everybody's seen an animal pin, so... I'll just show you guys a glimpse over the fence of what it looks like. It's a mess. Yeah, we got some horses in there. Some We've got skelly horses. Skelly horses somewhere. I think I see one over there. It's pretty cool. Horses, cows. But yeah, a jumbled mess right now. Sheep, pigs. <laughs> everything. Or everything, but but chicken. But chickens. Yeah, the chickens we have separated over here. I, uh, this is actually a little chicken restaurant that we have that I built and it's kind of cool um, show it real quick um, a little booth here and then got like a little bigger booth over here a little bar area and then this just be behind the counter so yeah a little fireplace and then back here is where all the, the chicken coops are at access yeah um I guess that's about all for this building. It's kind of cool. I like the detail I put into it. Um, looks pretty good. I'm happy with it. Well, we might want to go sleep in my big house. Yeah, let's go over to your big house. We can show it off, too. Check out these custom trees along the way. Yeah, we're trying to add some custom trees uh, just to kind of make the area look a little more natural. This is kind of like a little one-bedroom uh, house or shack. Shack. We'll show you guys that here in a minute. Oh, crap. Let's get out of there, this creeper. Oh, yeah? We'll go bed somewhere else. Uh, we can go in here. I'll kill him. Uh, Let's. We need to take him out. He's not allowed in here. All right, oh, he's my dead. gosh. <laughs> I did not want to ruin my floor. There might be some dim areas there in there. There probably is. It's but, a big you know, floor. I, we've been... I mean, I've been working with this house for a minute, and that's the first creeper I've encountered, so... Right. That's not well, that's too bad. that's definitely not bad, but especially for an with an unfinished house. Right. So we have what these nice rooms down here that you're still working on. Yeah, I'm still working on the detail part, but they're clean. They're clean. They're getting there. And this is kind of like the main uh, area here with a little side living room over here, which is cool. Yeah, and you don't try to change the channel. We lost the remote years ago. <laughs> and I guess this would be kind of like a utilities or kitchen area. Um, yeah, it's it's what I've been using for storage while I'm building and stuff. It's it's definitely under construction still in here. I mean, I've got the structure up, but the details need to be added. Right. 
And yeah, this is, like I said, just uh, everything's kind of a work in progress right now. We really haven't even named um, the server or this world, so if anybody has any good suggestions, just... Some good medieval name. Yeah, leave them in the comments, and uh, we'll definitely consider them. Uh, this little one-bedroom uh, shack is kind of quaint and cute. Got flower pots all over the place. Give it some character. I like it. A uh, little wraparound deck with some nice seating, which is cool. It's very nice. Uh, I guess we'll go ahead and move on. I have a little restaurant here. Oh, and by the way, both these were built by Buster Socks. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Got to give her some credit. You start. Well, you can see it in the architecture. My signature. Oh yeah. Just the way I build. Um. So you got your like little uh, hostess stand here, huh? Yeah, I got the hostess stand, the serving window. Yeah, went with the cyan. And I don't know if you guys can tell, but these are tables. Right. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> and I've got this patio out here, which is nice, right on the water. Very cool. And you kind of you did the kitchen for the most part. I, I kind of I got lazy when it came to the kitchen, and you. Were oh yeah, I just put a little detail into it. The hallway is really nice. I like the narrow hallway there, and the kitchen. I just kind of put some you know some furnaces and and uh, got a little sink and maybe like a little freezer where you can you know put your stuff down in there. <laughs> and this is like a little a little serving station here, which is cool. Water up. Right. Looks good. Yeah. And I guess next door is another building by you, which is a uh, butcher shop. Butcher shop. Oh, yes, yeah. sir. Come in here and uh, get your order, what you need. And uh, back here would be kind of where the butcher would be working. And again, this little serving window right here. Uh, oh, yeah. That's nice. Yeah. I like that. So the butcher would be back here cutting up the meat, and you can see there's blood. Yeah, he's a nasty guy. He doesn't clean up after himself. <laughs> and then, uh, I guess, uh, this would be where your scraps would go. Yeah, it's like a garbage receptacle. Does it work? Um, yeah. It'll take it out to the river. <laughs> oh, yeah? Yeah. This oh, is eventually... This is just uh, going to be like the deep freeze? It's going to be the walk-in. I need to get some packed ice. Event. We're going to find that eventually. Right. So. Yeah, that's awesome. I want to go check out your little... Uh, oh, the garbage. The garbage disposal. Oh, yeah, nice. Where did my potato go? It's in there. Oh, I see it. Oh, it, oh, did it stay? It kind of went under this half slab right here, which is strange, but I'll take it. I got it back. <laughs> um, Over here, this was kind of like the place where we started the server, a little safe area. It's kind of like a little hobbit hole into the side of the cliff here. And it's kind of fancy. It's kind of where we've been storing all of our, our main... Well, it's our main storage area. And we got a little sleeping area down here, a little bedroom. And also on this side, it uh, goes down to our mines. And this is our enchanting area that we've already got. And you can see that we're already pretty geared up. Um, and we got quite a few diamonds also. I'm not sure exactly how many. I think we got like 50. Yeah. 47. And a couple blocks. So. Oh, I used three to fix my uh, my shovel. That's okay. That would um, be okay. I worked for them. Right. <laughs> I think that's about all. Um, we have this little, this reed shop here. We can show that real quick. Yeah, that's, that's, that is all, isn't it? Yeah, I this is the final that. building. Um, and this is also done by Buster Socks. Got her signature. Right. <laughs> And basically, it's maybe like two shops in one because over here you can get all of your sugar and um, paper. Yeah, paper eventually, probably. It's it's kind of like a reed and reed accessory shop. Well, right. Accessories, is reed products. And then back here products. would be where Just the reeds are sold. Reeds. And then back here you've got your reed farm. Oh, the yeah. And like a worker. Owner. Yeah, comes back here and... Oh, I'm out of inventory. Let me grab some. Right. Oh, I got some of those. <laughs> Peace. Right. A little chilling spot here, too. That's kind of cool. Oh, well, that's not a reed. That's a rose. But, yeah. I think that's about all we have for this area so far. We'll definitely come back and uh, 
show you guys more um, we get more progress done so I guess for now hope you guys enjoyed and we will see you again next time let us know if y'all think of a name oh yeah let us know if you guys think of a name for this place take it easy guys till next time bye